Kula Yoga and Wellness recently celebrated its official grand opening on Algoma Street. After a warm welcome from Mayor Keith Hobbs, fellow community leaders participated in a Yoga Pose for Charity event. What we're going to have is each, each one of the leaders is going to have five minutes with one of our instructors. They're going to coach them on a pose and then we're going to have a pose off. Um, so they'll all be um, beautifully showing their humanity and coming out and doing this pose and we're going to rank them and whoever has the least, uh, the lowest score, like a golf score, is the winner and they're going to be getting a check from Kula for $250 to their favorite charity. The judges' votes were tallied and Patty Haryu, the executive director of Shelter House Thunder Bay, was declared the winner. I may have had an advantage as a yoga practitioner, however, uh, what we were asked to do was to really work on our tree pose and each person got assigned a coach. I had Janet Adams, who is a long time yoga st uh, studio teacher, and so I was taught, you know, really to focus, uh, to relax, to uh, make sure that I wasn't distracted by everything going on around me, and then to actually smile, which she said would win me the competition, and I think it might have. So the cause that I chose was, of course, the charity that I run, which is Shelter House. Um, Shelter House is a nonprofit charity that offers emergency and longer supportive housing to 77 men, women, and youth every single night in Thunder Bay. And we also feed an, an astronomical number of people who are living in poverty. We feed 700 meals a day, uh, which is really through the charity of the community and through the volunteerism that is alive and well. And so we look for any opportunity to uh, augment the money that we do get through government sources, and this was a wonderful opportunity to do that. For Go Thunder Bay, I'm Steve Johnson.